Hey Fight Fans, this is Richard Schaefer and you're watching Sporting Icons. Okay, so this storyline popped up on my social media feed, which is Deontay Wilder is willing to have two fights against Francis Ngannou, one in the boxing ring and the other one in the cage. No, no, no. I don't want to see Wilder get hurt. I don't. Because you put him in the cage with Francis Ngannou, you will hear his little legs snap like you're walking through the forest standing on twigs. So his little legs will get brutalized. Now, listen, I don't follow UFC or anything like that. I heard Francis Ngannou is more of a striker, not necessarily somebody who's necessarily great on the ground. But still, he'll, he'll know how to do it regardless. All he's got to do is rugby tackle Wilder, get him to the ground, and it won't take too much to get Wilder over because his legs are so skinny that he won't be able to hold himself up. He can barely hold himself up in the boxing ring when he's throwing punches. He's always off centre. What's it be like in the cage? He will get absolutely destroyed. It would be a bloodbath. I don't want to see that. I really, really don't want to see that. Now, don't get me wrong. I'll probably watch it through morbid curiosity. But in the boxing ring, okay. You have to favour Deontay Wilder, of course. He is former WBC World Heavyweight Champion. As limited as what he is, boxing is his thing. Francis Ngannou is not a boxer. He's a mixed martial artist. He may well be good at striking and all that kind of stuff, but not against professional boxers. Now, I'm not going to say if he lands on Wilder, he wouldn't get Wilder out of there. Maybe he would. Apparently, he punches stupidly hard. So maybe... Maybe he will get Wilder out of there. Wilder ain't the greatest around the whiskers. But as far as people maybe fighting in Ngannou, one in the cage, one in the boxing ring, there's more suitable candidates that would be more interesting, which would be like Dillian White. Dillian White has experience in the cage. He's a former martial artist himself with kickboxing that as well. Kubrat Pule, big baby Jaron Miller. You see, they have background in kickboxing and mixed martial arts. So... Not that I would favour any of those in the cage against Francis Ngannou, of course not, but at least they've got a better chance. I couldn't even see Wilder surviving training camp for a mixed martial arts fight. I couldn't see it. The poor man would be paralysed. So no, I don't particularly want to see that. I said I'd watch it through morbid curiosity. I would. But, you know, the couple of UFC events that I have seen you know I've seen people's legs their shins get snapped like Conor McGregor and a couple of other people imagine somebody kicks Wilder on those legs gone gone that's it not just snapped but removed you'll find from his kneecap down to his foot in row Z unbelievable drop your thoughts below click thumbs up subscribe catch your next video